What's up everybody, Andre Fluellen here, man. I'm just gonna be talking to you today about Pitch Battle. I'm excited about Pitch Battle. Pitch Battle is three African-American founders pitching the three superstar athlete judges to see who can take home the crown of the best pitch out there. And this is why we're doing this, because we're trying to give African-American and black founders a shot, right? Like too often we've seen good founders that don't get the shot that they deserve because of what they look like. And we think that that's just ridiculous. And so here's our job. Here's our way of beyond the game. It's our way to figure out how we can give these founders a shot. And look, I want you to know this. And here's our real, here's the reason why we're doing this. See, beyond the game, we do invest in companies. And guess what? Nine of our 12 investments have had a founder that is either African-American or female, minority or female. That's huge. So we've been doing this, okay? So, but here's the real why. And I'm going to step on some toes real quick. But... See, I think that everything that's been going on with the racial injustice and the racial inequality, and you see these big companies that said they're, they're, you know, taking the charge against racial inequality. You know, six weeks ago, that sounded real, real good. How about lately? See, we don't really hear about it much anymore lately. See, a lot of these companies have been promoting racial injustice by their practices in the past. And now they're saying, oh, I'm gonna take the charge. I'm gonna donate $700 trillion to black and African-American people because we believe in the cause. No, you don't. No, that's not how it goes. See, if you haven't been doing something, you're not gonna keep doing it. And don't use this as an opportunity to elevate yourself, to get yourself even more status. And we've seen it too often. All right, just think, just think about it like this. Let's pretend this is a rubber band. This is one of my daughter's little hair doohickeys. Okay, let's say I have to walk around all day with this thing stretched out. Every, everywhere I go, I gotta walk, I gotta talk with it stretched out, I gotta walk with it stretched out, I gotta do everything with this thing stretched out, okay? So after a while, man, at first, guess what? I'll be able to do it. Why? Because my attention is focused on it. Everything is focused on the fact that I have to have this thing stretched out. But after a while, man, guess what? I'm gonna do something and I'm not even gonna notice that it, that it fell off. And that's exactly what happens. See, that's what's been happening. As things start to fizzle out, as things start to sizzle out, it's because, man, there was never, ever, ever a focus on it before. See, like that rubber band, man, that's not natural to me. Why? Because I've never had to walk around with a rubber band tied around my finger, stretched out around my finger. I've never had to do that. And so therefore, if I've never had to do that or I've never done that, the likelihood of me being successful at doing that all day <laughs> is really, really low. And that's the same thing that's been happening. That's the same reason why we're doing pitch battle is because we are trying to continuously and consistently draw attention and give these founders a shot. See, sometimes I actually feel like, like I feel like people want to care because they feel like they're supposed to care. See, you got, you got to understand that. See, people want to care because they feel like they're supposed to care. But here's the thing. I want you to care because you want to care. See, I want some of these companies that are doing some of these things, man, I want them to do it because they want to do it, not because they feel like they're supposed to do it or because they have to do it. Because if they feel like they're supposed to do it or feel like that they have to do it, that they're forced to do it, man, when it comes to a point in time where they don't have to do it, guess what? They ain't going to do it. See, I want them to want to do it. I'll put it in a little bit of country vernacular. You don't got to help black founders. You get to help black founders. You ain't got to. You get to. You ain't got to do it. You get to do it. So guys, this is the reason why we're doing this. Three black founders pitching the three superstar athlete judges. Not because it's a charity case, but because we're looking for the best. And one thing about athletes, especially professional athletes, they know what the best looks like. So I got one question to ask you. What's your pitch? Peace.